Well, new reaction this morning to Governor Kasich's State of Ohio address last night. Only the Democrats were available for comment last night on the speech, and WKBN's Dennis Riviano has new details on how they sized up the governor's words. Good morning. Hey, good morning to you, Amy and Damon. Governor John Kasich's State of the State speech focused on education and taxes, but at no time during his 64-minute speech was there any mention of oil, gas, drilling, or fracking. And that has State Representative Nick Barbarak of Lisbon concerned. Barbarak says he would like to see Kasich commit to investing money to eastern Ohio in districts that are affected by shale drilling. Now, State Representative Bob Hagan, he had some harsh words for the governor, saying he doesn't think Kasich deserves a second term. Hagan says the entire speech was political and says the governor has failed the state of Ohio. He offers all these programs, but then he's going to cut taxes. You know, first you have it, then it disappears. I think it's utterly ridiculous that he's making these promises, promises that he can't keep, promises that he's been making for three years, and promises to the Mahoning Valley that he's been leaving out year in and year out. We heard program after program, but coupled with tax cuts. And, and I'm not sure how the governor plans on paying for these things, except to think that perhaps he plans on taking the money right from eastern Ohio and distributing it throughout the state, and I think that's a mistake. Also in attendance, State Representative Ron Gerberry, he says he was concerned that Kasich did not mention a single word about local government funding. And of course, you can count on us to bring you all the very latest reaction from the State of the State later on tonight. Keep it here on our website, WKBN.com. Amy?